This technique is so advanced that even driving the speed limit is an experience. And yet he's still in complete command of the road. If there's such a thing as perfect technique, this might be it. I pull up with no hood attached and a backwood lit. Pistons pushing heavy underneath the full. Alright, what's going on, guys? My name's Chris. For the people who don't know me, I basically make a bunch of Instagram videos. I make a couple YouTube videos, but I've been wanting to do something new with my channel, which is gonna be video series of my car, basically. Uh, I'm super into cars. I always have been ever since I was like six years old. Uh, I actually got my first car toy when I was six from the mall. It was a orange 350Z. And two months ago, I actually picked up a Z, but it's not a 350. I actually picked up a 300ZX. So it's a 1990 300ZX, uh, the non-turbo one because I don't think it can handle that much power with twin turbos right now, but hopefully soon uh, I'll have twin turbos, but for now I'm keeping it NA. I really like the NA just because it's, it's super clean. I mean, I don't drift it or anything. I don't, I don't go super fast in it. It's enough power for me, but um, soon, sooner or later I'm going to put a little bit more power into it. So basically, I'm just gonna be doing like a video series of my car. Um, I've seen a lot of people do it, but I'm gonna be like vlogging every once in a while, like doing like maintenance or like basically whatever I do with the car, I'm gonna put it online just for you guys to see what, what it's like owning one of these cars, which is honestly pretty shitty because they're really hard engines to work on and everything's so packed into such a little space that it's honestly really frustrating to work on, but I have like a lot of people that are gonna help me with this and basically just make this a whole new car. A lot has actually already been done to this car from previous owner. He did the clutch, flywheel, new injectors. He got these wheels, they're only 16 inches, but um, they're called pacers, I don't really know. I kinda like them, but I wanna need them a little bit more low. The front is all right, just cause it's on springs. And the backs are also on springs too. It's just, there's a little cup like inside that's flipped upside down. And if I turn it right side up, it'll drop it as low as the front. So I need to do that soon. I'm probably gonna go and get that fixed. So yeah, basically I'm just gonna first start off by lowering the back. Um, here's the interior. My friend actually took off the door panels. So it's pretty much gutted from the door panels. The seats are a little bit ripped. Um, I'll show you the trunk too. The trunk is fully gutted. Uh, just have my bike and like rags, um, fucking camera stuff, uh, shoes, stuffed animal. But yeah, it's pretty much gutted, but I think I'm just gonna keep this part gutted and work on the front. I actually got a new exhaust. A lot of people are gonna hate it, but I don't really care, I love it. So yeah, I just went with the Bozo tips. So it's basically two and a half inch uh, pipes. Uh, my friend Scott actually did this exhaust. He's the one who actually owned this car before me, so shout out to him for doing like all the work. I would have never been able to do it just cause it, that just sounds like too much work to me, but. Yeah, he put a lot of work into this car, so I, sh I have to shout him out for that just because, like, I don't know. I would never be able to do any of that stuff. Putting the starter in was hard enough for me, but I'm just, I'm still learning, so. All this is just going to be me learning. You guys watching me learn. I really love this car to death, and I, I just want to make it as nice as possible. Basically, just a clean daily. Probably take it to shows every once in a while. But I live, I live like four hours away from LA. So I'll probably go up to LA every once in a while or the Bay, but for now, I think I'm just gonna just drive it how it is. But yeah, I got a, I got a lot of plans for this car. It's just, uh, it's gonna take a little bit of time. I do work full time, so I should have videos out every, every couple weeks, just cause uh, I mean, I right when I get my checks, I just dump it all into this car. Which, which is which is kind of stupid, but I don't know. I think it's worth it. I don't think I'm gonna drift it. I think I'm just gonna have it super low, 
super clean. Gonna do the maintenance. So transmission, fluid, um, oil. Uh, I have a couple seals I need to do underneath my car, so it's gonna be like. But yeah, that's basically gonna be it. Um, I'm gonna have updates on my Instagram, so follow me on Instagram at Saki Films. I'll put it like right here. But yeah, other than that, I'll just be posting updates on my car. I should have a couple maintenance videos out. Be sure to comment, subscribe if you want, but totally up to you guys. Just tell me what you think. This is like my first time doing something like this. So I'm gonna need a lot of input. I don't care if it's bad, good. Just uh, tell me what you guys think. Uh, thanks for watching guys, peace.